My name is Saranya and I am from Cambridge School of Standard 6. So today I am going to say you an interesting topic of Beauty Pie. Uh, so today my topic is round off number. So this project works like uh, when you click 14.9 14 or 40.9 uh, when you estimate it you will get the answer as 50 and if you type 15.4 you get the answer as 15 itself. So like that I have created a project. So I want to share this project with you all. So I am creating this project. So let us start the project now. So now I have opened my Google web page. So over here I have QtPy login page. So I am opening that now. In my last video I have said you what's the link of that. If you want you can refer my last video. Now I will sign in my QtPy with my Google account. Then your page will come like this. You have to click on start new project and start your new project. And now I named my project as round off number without giving any spaces. Then I am clicking on enter icon like this or you can click on ok over here will be located in my projects now if I open my project it comes like this and my project had opened now let us start the designer part so before I have created my designer part already I'm just showing you I have actually changed my background color but defaultly the background color actually come as white okay now let us start it now so in your palette section you will have in user interface in user interface you will have label drag and drop that label first drag and drop it two times so it will be like this then you have to click on label one in label one go to the property section in properties you will have text for label one rename that as round of number then make the font size as 25 then make the font size as bold then click on label 2 in label 2 go to the properties in the properties you have to make again the font as bold the font size as 17 after making it as 17 you have to come down and over here you will have text so again in the text make the text for label 2 as enter the number after doing that in the components you will have screen click on that then in that you will have properties so go to the algin horizontal and make the left one as center 3 then in the palettes you will have user interface so in the user interface you have to go to the text box so drag and drop this text box after and dragging onto your viewer it your screen will be like this then again in the palette under the user interface you will have button drag and drop that button and put it onto your viewer screen after you put it onto your viewer come to the components in the components click on the button one and in the button one you will have rename so click on that rename after you click on rename it the icon comes like this uh, like a dialog box so make the dialog box into result then click on ok after you click on ok again in the property section come down to the text box and again type over here result after you make it as result you have to again go to the palette. In the palette, you will have user interface. Again, in the user interface, you have to go to label and drag and drop the label. After you drag and drop the label, you have to go to the properties and make this text. Um, in the text, you will have text for label 3. Make that as blank. Now, the designer part is done. Let us go to the blocks. 
so now i have opened my blocks let us start it now for the round of number we have a small coding part it's a very easy and simple coding part i'll show you how the coding part looks let us go into our coding part this is how i created my code let us code it now i'll show you where are these symbols located in this all the main one is this round icon this is the main one which we want to create a project so now i'll show you all the blocks where are they located so in the screen one you will have result so click on that result and take the when result click do which will be the first icon drag and drop that onto your viewer screen after that go to the label one and click on that after you open you will get the options like this you can select set label 3 background 2 or any icon which is similar to these sets so i am choosing set label 3 background color 2 let us drag and drop that one after you drag that come and make it join with this let us join it with that after you join make the background color as text so your code will be like this next you have to go to math then you have to click on math after you open math over here you will have round i had found out the round now let us drag and drop this onto our viewer screen So after we drag and drop it onto your viewer screen you have to join it with set label 3 text to round then you have another step to do box 1 and click on that after you click on that you can drag again any of these ones uh, which are similar to this i am dragging text box 1 multi line or any other source which you like so i'm joining it with round so after i join it with round i made the line multi line as text so your first code is done can you guess what's the second code yeah obviously this this is use it for closing the application it's very easy to drag and drop this one i'll show you how does we do that So now we have to go to the screen one, and in screen one, you have to drag down and down so that you will find the first icon as when screen one back pressed. Drag and drop that one. After you drag and drop that, you have to come to the control. After you open control. drag it down until you find an application called close application so drag and drop that block and place it over here after you place it over here your blocks will also be done now let us scan the qr code do you all want me to show how does the qr code scanning should be done okay i'll show it to you you have to come to the build and in build you'll have app provide your code for ask so open that so your barcode will proceed here this is how our barcode will be now it's getting scanned let's wait for us to show the barcode it's been for 100% now let us wait for the qr code to come Yeah, now we got the QR code. Let us scan it now. See, my QR code had been scanned. Let's wait for the result. Now let me click on open. So I'll click on install, and it will get installed right now. Now I'll click on open. My screen had been come. Now let us type something like fifteen. Point nine and click on result. Yeah, it's working. Nine seventeen sixteen. Let me reduce it. Yes, my app is working. Hope you like.
like the video if you like the video please join jack beautify classes to learn more and explore more it's a very simple and easy process did you all like it and thank you for watching my video